breathlessness is the sensation of shortness of breath or difficulty breathing. It is a very common symptom in people with advanced disease, cancer or non-cancer diseases such as heart disease. It is common for palliative care patients to experience shortness of breath at some stage through their illness. It is often described as a difficult symptom as it can be very uncomfortable and anxiety provoking for the person experiencing it and also very difficult to watch for family and carers. Causes for breathlessness include chronic problems affecting the heart or lungs, such as emphysema, bronchitis, heart failure, arrhythmias or heart rhythm problems, and also cancer affecting the lungs, for example lung cancer or cancer that has spread to the lungs. A low blood count may also cause breathlessness, as there is less oxygen carrying capacity. Breathlessness is not always due to low oxygen levels. Often general strength, fatigue, breathing muscle mechanics play a role too. For example, a patient with a distended abdomen with fluid or ascites in it may feel pressure pushing onto the chest causing breathlessness without the lungs being affected directly. Most patients notice breathlessness particularly when they are doing activities beyond resting such as walking or showering. Breathlessness commonly provokes anxiety. Often people find it easier to breathe when they are sitting upright. There is a range of tests for breathlessness in a previously healthy patient including a chest x-ray, an ECG, blood tests and more. In the palliative care setting, the extent of investigation depends on the situation and patient preferences. Most people find some relief of their breathlessness with symptomatic management, but often a degree of breathlessness remains. There are medication-based strategies and non-medication related strategies. In terms of medications, common medications include morphine type medications that change the perception of breathlessness. They have been shown to be helpful not only for pain but also for breathlessness. They are safe to use in small doses and titrated to symptoms. Anti-anxiety medications such as benzodiazepines are another group of medications that may be helpful. Some people may benefit from oxygen at home. Non-medication related strategies include physiotherapy input for energy conservation techniques and breathing strategies. If you are experiencing breathlessness, it is important you consult your doctor for medical advice.